Hello everyone! Today I'm going to be planning my seven day self portrait challenge and yes I'm doing another one. I did one back in October if you didn't see that I'll link it all below so you can go have a look at it but basically I did a self portrait a day and a video a day for seven days straight. So today is the day that I plan the next one. I'm going to be doing it from the 9th of April to the 15th of April which is Monday to Sunday. That is in, I think it's like six weeks is it? Four weeks? Maybe not. Yeah it's definitely four weeks time. <laughs> Last time I think I planned this project in like probably like two months, maybe three months, which means that I had a lot more time to prepare props and everything. I'm currently sat on a bed that I made up for my friend Abby last weekend. I am in my office or the studio. I've just not had time to take the bed down so I'm just gonna leave it and I'm gonna sit and I'm gonna plan and I have this big whiteboard which I got the other day and I've got some coloured whiteboard pens. They are whiteboard aren't they? Let's just make sure. Yeah, dry wipe marker. Can you imagine if I've just written on it? What I'm gonna do is plan out the seven days. On the seventh day this year, I'm gonna be announcing something. I'm gonna keep it a secret till the day, but I will be announcing something very special. So the seventh day is going to be the most exciting day for me, and I do have a plan for that. At this point in time, I don't have that many ideas for this project. I currently live in the south of England, and my parents live up north, which is where I'm from, and I'm gonna be up there for a wedding on the 7th of April. Probably stay that week and do the, the project there. And I think it might be a little bit easier because where I live up north, well, where my parents live, where I was brought up, you know what I mean? I, I still class it as home. <laughs> yeah, they have a big, big garden, sort of like fields and wilderness. And I feel like I just, I'm feeling more inspired to do this project up north and I can create bigger props because I have more storage space there. So I have got one prop which I'm not sure if you'll have seen the image by then but it is a big giant moon. I'm probably going to use that prop so I'm going to draw it here. Oh that was not good. <laughs> it's not good. Let's start that again. I am going to do eight sections and keep one of the sections for notes, um, but I just want to do it like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, obviously. One, two, three. Oh god, I am not good at drawing straight. <laughs> yeah, what I intend to do is to draw some of the prop ideas, Not maybe not necessarily the image idea, just some props and some notes. Because last year I did draw out all the ideas beforehand and also made all the props beforehand just to make the shooting of the props and the organisation of it easier, which helped so much. This is terrible, look what I've done. That is not straight at all. <laughs> Let's just go with it. I'm going to prop it up. So one of my props that I'm thinking of doing is, I'm not going to explain it completely because I don't obviously want to give away what I'm doing, but it means buying lots and lots and lots and lots of fake flowers. I'm thinking of doing that on day one, so I'll probably just write this down. The next one is Tuesday the 10th. Think of some ideas. In fact, I'm going to get my book of ideas. So I'm just going to look through here and see if I've got any ideas that I wanted to do or if I want to come up with some new ideas. I quite like to do that one. So I'm going to draw this out. So I'm not really sure, 100% sure what I'm going to do yet, but we have balloons for day two. What should we have for day three? I think day three I'm going to do, I think I might do the big prop. Then day four, I'm going to have a look again through here. As you can see, I'm just writing down symbols. I'm not doing the actual image idea. I think what I'm gonna do is just do the symbols so it reminds me of what props that I need to make or get. So day five, which is a Friday, Friday the 13th, so I feel like I have to do something around that. So I might just draw a 13. There we go. And then Saturday, so let's have a look again in my book. So I've got an idea potentially for Saturday and it's probably going to be a levitation image because I've done a few levitation images but I've always wanted to do one with a certain prop. And then Sunday is the last day so that's the most exciting day because 
I've got my announcement. So I'm gonna come up with a image that represents this announcement. So I'm gonna just write announcement for now. Whoa. <laughs> or I'll put like a little. And there we go. That is my plan. Last year, rather than just having seven ideas for seven days, I made about 10 ideas so that if one idea didn't work, I had a little backup uh, idea. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep this one free for a couple of like notes just about different ideas and have a think about it. But I think I'm very happy with what I've got at the minute. Here is my little plan. It might be a little bit brief at the minute, but it's just gonna get me thinking over the next few days about what exactly I want to do for each sort of idea and prop and it just helps me visualise the ideas. I also wanted to invite you to do this project with me. I'm doing it obviously from the 9th to the 15th of April. I'll be posting it in my Facebook group so that everyone can join if they want to. Yeah, that is pretty much it. I'm very excited to do it again this year. I think I'm gonna make it every six months. Find it. it's just really good to like have an amazing burst of creativity. It's like last year's was so rewarding. After I was absolutely dead and exhausted and after every single day, I was like, oh my God, this is so hard. But it was so rewarding. I would 100% try it. If you're a creative fan photographer and you're interested in getting to self portraits, I'd perhaps just try it as a little challenge to yourself. You don't need to have to post it anywhere, but I just find that if you have sort of a seven day absolute intense burst of creativity it really gets your juices flowing and you're just coming out with ideas left right and center and that's what happened to me anyway i'll keep you updated with all the props that i'm doing over probably on my instagram yeah i'm really excited i'll leave it here and i'll see you in my next video bye